good stuff. Alright, perfect. Prepare a Wiley Ballard graphic. Do you want me to start the stream? We start the stream. Camera three. Beautiful. Oh, we're coming in on one. For more information on how your school can join the student broadcast program, visit nfhsnetwork.com slash svp. Zekia Stadium at Michigan State University hosted the 2015 MHSAA softball finals, and the day started with Wayland Union and Frankenmuth squaring off in Division II. Wayland used the long ball to take the win, including a final record two taters by Leah Morse, the first in the second inning, and then again in the seventh, the latter a three-run shot. Look at that Wayland Union bench go crazy. A line drive home run to left. And suddenly it's 11 to nothing. You talk about creating a memory. Bethany Tunison also had a home run in the seventh inning for the Wildcats, which won their second softball title in the school's history, 11 0. The Division I game saw Warren, Regina, and Caledonia, the Satellites looking for a sixth championship, the Scots in the finale for the first time. The only run Regina would need would come on this fourth inning triple by Haley Reese. But the winners added four more runs in the next frame, highlighted by a two-run double by Riley Hisson. Regina captures the Division II championship for the first time since 2007 by a 5-0 score. Next up was Division IV and a pair of perennial powerhouses, Unionville Seaboing and Kalamazoo Christian having at for top honors. It was all USA in this one. Madison Zimmer singles home two runs in the fourth inning. And Nicole Bauer did the same in the fifth frame. The Patriots headed back to the thumb with their fourth title in the school's history, 5-0 over the Comets. The Division III championship wrapped up the day with a pair of teams hungry for their first title, Monroe St. Mary Catholic Central and Bronson. The lone highlight from this one was its only Aaron scoring play, where Kestrel pitcher first. Megan Bobian helped her own cause with a two-run homer in the very first well. inning. Way back and gone! Home run! Megan Bobian with a two-run home run to help her own cause. Bobian lost her bid for a perfect game in the final frame, but nailed her 14th strikeout to finish the issue and give St. Mary's Catholic Central a 2-0 victory. 